Hello friends, welcome to BSC Agriculture. If you are coming to my channel for the first time, then don't forget to hit the subscribe button. So let's move to the video. In this video, we are going to see about fundamental entomology crop wise pest classification, and I am going to cover the topic pest of Anala. So first, I have given the insect name as well as their scientific name as well as the family uh, in the first slide. So let's move to move on to the video. So the first one is leaf ro roller and the scientific name is Caloptila acidula and the family is Gracilaridae and the order Lepidoptera. So while seeing about its host strain, it is the insect which you use it to affect only the Aonla and also while seeing about the binomics, the larva which is said to be a cylindrical as well as greenish yellow with the thin scattered hairs present in the larva and the larva which is said to be pupated in the leaf fold as well as the pupal period is said to be around 8 to 10 days and the adult which is said to be a small brownish color moth and so while seeing about the damage which was caused by the leaf roller of anola is the use to mine parts of the leaves as well as the whole leaflets uh, compounds in the plants and also which used to make them pale brown or brown color and also the intervening space filled with black excreta which used to show the indication of the infection of a leaf roller present in the own law forms and also in several cases the leaf plates are said to be twisted around in the whole plant so the next one is amla apical twig gall maker so where the scientific cream is rhodoneura emblicus and also which used to come under the order lepidoptera so it is said to be a major pest of amla in major parts uh, in some parts of the india and it used to attack in the nurseries as well as in orchards particularly in the rainy season in the time of june to august and also while seeing about its damage symptom the caterpillar which used to penetrate the apical portion of the shoot and in the monsoon also and also used to feed inside the tissue as well as which makes the apical tissue changing into galls and the also there is a growth of shoot into hampered and also few lateral shoots which used to develop as galls in the whole plant and also while seeing about its damage symptom we can able to see a blackish caterpillar found inside every gall so it is said to be a important pest in amla and also while seeing and there you can able to see a gummy secretion which was caused by these insects and the next one is fruit borer where the scientific name is Eudrox is isocrates and while seeing about the symptom of damage the larva which used to bore into fruit in different phases and also the young larva which used to form a tender fruit and the grown up larva which used to attack the mature fruits so the infested tender fruit which used to turn brown initially uh, on the first stage of attack and which used to turn black later as well as uh, due to the secondary infections in amla and so the management of these insect and pests in these insects are the collection and destruction of damaged fruits as well as the removal of alternative hosts like pomegranate gova support or tamarind in the nearby fields so and also maintaining uh, the alternate host not in that particular area is an effective one and also release of trico colonies 10 days interval at four times and uh, also we can able to release trichogramma chylonensis at 15 cc per hectare and also a positional deterrence like neems neem oil 3 percent or neem seed kernel extract 5 percent spray is an effective one and the next one is fruit piercing moth where the scientific name is eudosimma materna and some other species are Eudosimma fulonica as well as Ancilla. And so these are adult moth which use it to suck the sap from fruits and they also may, may use it to make the fruits puncture in the whole plant. And um, while seeing the management of these fruit moth, there is a removal of weed plants present in the amla and also destruction of fallen and decaying fruits where because due to there can be a presence of eggs of these insects and smoking is said to be an important management we can able to do in the amla field and the collection of moth at the evening by hand nets and the collection of semilupur from weeds and creepers a light trap is used to maintain as well as uh, monitor these presence of insects in the field and on destruction in the kerosenized water below such light is an effective one and also we can be able to use poison baits or carbide 2 gram per liter in the spraying of an amla plants is said to be an effective management and uh, the next one is 
Borg borer where the scientific name is Interbola tenanosis and is used to make tunnel in the trunk and branches and larva is used to construct irregular webbing and silkening of thread along the excretory pellets and uh, which used to cause a reduction of yield in the amla production so the management is killing larva by inserting a thin iron spike and a wire into the hole and also we can able to go for spot application of 10 ml of monocrotopos or phenethion or methyl parathion at 1 ml per liter of water is an effective one and the next one is aphids where the scientific name is cetaphis uh, villa is the particular kind of aphid which used to affect on amla so the symptom of damage is as usual as other crops the nymph and adult which used to suck sap by remaining under the surface of uh, leaves and, uh, and is used to cause yellowing of leaves and management is a removal of weeds uh, as well as field release of cyprites or uh, aphid population uh, cyprites which used to control aphid populations rapidly and a field release of green lace wings chrysoferla carnea and spraying of neem oil at 3% is an effective management and the next one is white fly where the scientific name is trilorodus rara and the symptom of damage where the nymph and adult which used to suck sap from the undersurface of the leaves and the yellowing of leaves on the dorsal side in patches is said to be in uh, the major symptom of white flies and the management is removal and destruction of alternate waste host and the use of yellow pan traps and spray neem seed kernel extract 5% and neem oil at 5 ml per liter and spraying of fish oil rosin soap at 25 grams per liter of water is uh, these are the effective management we can be able to go on against white flies and the next one is uh, the bug where the scientific name is cutelaria noblis and uh, which is to be comes under the order order hemiptera so the host strain you choose to have different types of host strain and adult which is said to be a blue metallic green bug and the damage caused by these bugs are they use it to suck the sap from the leaves and it twist which you uh, use it to causes yellowing of leaves and the next one is mealy bug where the scientific name is ferris variegata the symptom of damage where they use it to cover tender growing points with the white moss they use it to suck the sap and also uh, reduce the vitality of these plants in the orchard so the management is early de direction of mealy bugs uh, with the presence of indicate uh, ants present which use it to also act as an indicators in the plants and a ca cutting that infected twigs and leaves and burning them is an effective management uh, if the incidence is higher we can be able to go for the release of in um, predators like chrysoperla carnea and some species of ladybird beetles such as Chylocorca species or Clipturia monotrisa or which is said to be an effective predator in the management. So I have given the lecture notes in the description. So if you please comment up the video and join us in the Instagram page. I have also given the link in the description. So if you like the video, like it and share it with your friends and subscribe to BSC Agriculture and hit the bell icon to get regular updates. So thanks for watching the video. I'll catch up in next videos.